filming this at the same time as I'm filming or I filmed the um, type one photograph video. So same lighting. If you didn't like it, you get it. You're stuck with it for today too. I wanted to do a quick video on ripping wax and how it almost never pays off financially. You know, you're going to pay 50 bucks for a mega box from Walmart and the chances of you getting $50 worth of cards, slim, very slim. You should always buy singles. Um, there's a, a great example here by Eric Whiteback on Twitter, the collectibles guru, where in 2021 select football, which was $850 per box, the top hit was the Trevor Lawrence gold autograph, number to 10, just sold for 1200 bucks. So the number one card went for barely more than one box. Something wrong there. That's just, it's way short. So yeah, my, one of my new year's resolutions is to not rip any wax in 2023. Very difficult because I love it. It's so much fun. And uh, I like going back into my cards from like 2000. Well, when I first started collecting in 2020, I had a subscription to Collectible Card Club. And so I'd open packs from 2015, 2016. And I like going back now and saying, oh, wow, this guy wasn't big in 2020, but now he's a big star. And I have this cool, I don't know, refractor or whatever. But ultimately, it's much better to just buy singles. Go to a show, buy singles, buy them off eBay, buy them off Com C. Whatever makes sense, it's not ripping wax. That being said, I love it. And I did find a incredibly cheap Topps Chrome Black auction for a hobby box. I'm going for half, oh, just a little more than half of what they've been going for a month earlier. So I bought one. And I'm going to open it right here and right now and go through what that's like. And it'll probably be my last ripped box in a while and i have next week coming up i filmed myself opening up a couple of hangers and a uh, blaster and i'll post that next week at some point all right i'm gonna flip it around all right so tops chrome black hobby box there are four cards in here uh, i think there's two base one refractor and one autograph and that autograph list is loaded. The checklist is loaded with Hall of Famers and superstars, but there's also guys like Bobby Dalbeck, Mike Yastrzemski, Joe Ryan. That uh, I, I've, I've watched some videos. My friend Ryan has watched a bunch of videos of people opening cases of these and getting nothing but junk. So I'm hoping that they got those all out of the way. And I've got like a... <clears throat> Shohei Superfractor in here. Or a David Ortiz. Let's see what we've got. Let's actually... We're going to do, like, Pac-Man. <clears throat> and use my Lucky Jordan... And, oh, there's a pack. Okay. I saw, I saw a color on the autograph. I didn't see who it was, though. All right. We've got a rookie of Spencer Torkelson. Not bad. I'll take that. And I love these cards. Look at the design. The design is spectacular. Got a Seiya Suzuki rookie. Not bad. So far, so good. And now my refractor is a Max Scherzer. At least he's a future Hall of Famer. And that's, it's the coolest card in the autographs. <clears throat> All right. You may have seen, it is a gold, or it looks like it's gold. Let's see who it is. Oh, it's Cody Bellinger. Oh, no. Gold, number to 50. Uh, well, that's when I'll sell. I'm not interested in having a Cody Bellinger card. I'm going to hang on to it until spring, and hopefully he comes back and he's hot. But he is... 
if I had sold this a few years... There's my cat meowing like crazy. If I had sold this a few years ago, or actually if I pulled this a few years ago, I would have hung on to it because he was looking like a surefire Hall of Famer. But this is why you don't rip wax. Uh, <clears throat> what a bummer. But not surprising. Thankfully, I did not pay a ton for this because the price has plummeted. Base autograph, chrome black baseball, Cody Bellinger, number to 50. What a bummer. <laughs> All right, if you're new here, click that subscribe button. I'm putting out daily content. Today is day 37 in a row of putting out content. Thanks very much for watching.